off of West Belfast GPRG, we would like to take this opportunity to welcome a native Venus Soilist family to the Whitfield Road on day 254 of our campaign to return our brother to the Bonson home. And it's both an honour and privilege to address you all today and reaffirm our total commitment to this campaign. Let us not lose sight of the reason why we are here today. We are here because of nationalist republican intolerance of the Protestant community and its culture. This intolerance has manifested itself in the latest outlandish claims this week by Sinn Féin IRA and the SDLP claiming our 250th day protest parade was a show of paramilitary strength. This parade certainly was not, or nor ever has been, a paramilitary show of strength. It was peaceful, dignified and a lawful parade. May I take this opportunity to thank everyone who came along on the day and showed their support for our campaign and we look forward to many more peaceful, dignified parades in the coming days. This is in stark contrast to Republican parades where we see adults and children dressed in paramilitary uniforms, carrying weapons, scores of Republican terrorists in balakavas with Jerry Kelly senior, and senior members of Sinn Féin and the SDLP standing side by side with them. Jerry Kelly was pictured last year and needs to raise and pray with the Republican terrorist in the balaclava posing for a picture, or posing for a picture. Typical Sinn Féin, do as I say and not as I do. Let us make it clear, there is no threat coming from the Protestant community. Indeed, the threat comes from violent, dissident Republican extremists that are bombing and shooting and murdering members of not only the security forces, but members of the Catholic community. Sinn Féin and the SDLP would be better served working in their constituencies to address sectarian behaviours of Republicans instead of nitpicking and trying to stoke up trouble and give excuses to violent Republican extremists for their murderous campaign. Also this week we had the Alliance Party on a low state that she was supporting United Ireland. We all know what the Alliance stands for and it is an alliance we have palm nationalist front and a cold house for loyalism and unionism. Yeah. Let me state clearly here today to the Alliance Party on a low, Northern Ireland is not an artificial part of the United Kingdom. We are an integral part of the United Kingdom and we will continue to maintain the Union. Let's today not forget about those who find themselves getting took to court on trumped up charges, some of which are laughable, only for the seriousness of the situation individuals find themselves in. We as Belfast GPRG would like to offer support and advice to anybody who find themselves in these situations. We will continue to challenge the PSNI and the judiciary around these trumped up charges and at the highest level. In finishing, once again we would like to extend our thanks to the United Unionist Loyalist family and their commitment to this campaign and our message is simple, let them home.